I have three questions for Chef tonight. Question number one, the Masters, at the end of April, you brought up in your live the other night that if someone loaned you money, you would pay them back over three years at the end of April, like after the Masters, because that's when you make your big bucks, right? With your broker and all that. So if you have that much money at the end of April, why were you in Pinellas in April last year begging? And, you know, the rest of spring and summer. And now, if you have, like, that much money. My second question is also related to that money. If you had that much money, why didn't you just fix your lemon? Or why didn't you rent a car for Uber? Instead of, like, waiting and losing everything. Third question. The hotel situation. You're now looking at hotels that require a hundred dollars security or deposit that you're asking for us to pay on top of the hundred and twenty dollar a night. There are plenty of hotels on Expedia and Priceline that don't require a d deposit and are only sixty dollars a night. Why are you choosing those hotels? And another thing, if someone does give you a hundred dollars for deposit. You won't ever have to ask for that again, right? Because you'll just keep using it over and over again for your deposits? Or are you just going to pocket it and ask for another deposit? What are you going to do? 